there's an old Chinese saying, it's like going from the wolf's den into the tiger's den. <laughs> You're going from a precarious situation into another precarious situation. Okay, so I just realized that we can't actually see what's what kind of rewards we get uh, after we click on it. There we can see all of the rewards that we are getting. Let's go! Send! Molar fixture rain. It says you've seen the message from T Corp, right? Hmm. Huh? Oh, what? When we get that? Oh, oh bugger, I'm bought a warm. She threw a huge drunken party with her friends from the same corner of the back streets last night. Mika. They occupied the whole pub and got wasted all night, I heard. Uh, just how much did you drink this time? Oh, it rained. Uh, my head's still ringing from the hangover, so keep the lecture for later, yeah? Maybe an hour or so. And what's this? This receipt, receipt say you used our office funds to pay for it too. What? Oh, thank you for utilizing warp services as you always. The next train departing is warp train UW212. All passengers, please check your bag, pass, and make sure you are in the correct carriage for travel. And remember, watch for it. Warn us, we'll all be good. Seems it's our turn now. I always feel ill and out of sorts when I board warps trains. Just don't make an arse of yourself like the last time. Anyway, this request is rather unexpected. One from our corp of all places. Isn't it something right dangerous if uh, our corp has to request another party to do the job? They might be just using a no-name office like us as bait to test the waters uh, before they could do them do it themselves. Say, who's the client for that request? The captain of the rabbit team herself? <laughs> You kids might be thinking I'm just an easygoing drunkard, but every action of mine is calculated, you see? There she goes again. That meal lass is an old maid of mine. I drank with her just yesterday. You mean... Said she's got an easy job for me. Says all I got to do is give her a small cut of the rewards. No wonder you were so proud about going out for a drink. She's in a rather good mood, so I let her dine like a king and paid for all that with the office card. Well, <laughs> got swindled. <laughs> she just got swindled. Is Mio a trustworthy person? She acts like the hot head lass, but she's actually pretty nice deep inside when you get to know her. Swear down, I'll curse you for the rest of my life, it turns out to be weird nonsense again. All passengers, please board warp train UW212. Mary is another- oh, it's a passenger. It's nice to be on a vacation after so long. This is our first time taking a warp ride. Is everything gonna be okay? You're such a warrior, darling. So many people use warp every day. I heard there were several accidents when they were first starting out. You can just stay by my side and keep your eyes closed if you're so worried, silly. <laughs> I can't believe I actually did that voice. And I actually did it. Uh, I, in my opinion, I did it well, but I, uh, who knows? <laughs> when, uh, like, in my head, I did it well, but who knows when it. Uh, uh, when I actually hear myself, <laughs> how well it's going to turn out. Okay, I'll stick fast to you and hold tight. 
Take care of the mess if I happen to vomit on this carriage, Rain. Sis, please. Attention, all passengers. Please fasten your seatbelts. You're departing now. Boy, I've always wondered. What's the point of these seatbelts? Corsi, I suppose. Who knows? It might actually be better than nothing. We will be we, we will be initiating the warp in ten minutes. Oh, you! You're clinging onto me like a baby. Well, you never know. We'll be there just ten seconds after the train starts. But you're cute, so I'll let you be. Why do we, why do we have to sit right behind those two lousy lovebirds? Shut it, they'll hear us. Please do not open the doors while the train is in warp. I'll be taking a nap. Wake me up when you're there. It's gonna take less than 10 minutes anyway. Whatever. Big sis, big sis, wake up. Hell, what's it this time? Something seems to have gone wrong. It's been an hour since we departed, but the train still hasn't arrived at its stop. What's happening, Mary? You said we'd be there in just 10 seconds. That's strange. Shouldn't we take it shouldn't take any longer than that. Six hours yen. Oh, after six hours. Wait, did they turn did they warp into the library? Bollocks. Did we get unlucky or what? Warp hasn't had any accidents in the last 10 years though. We might end up getting trapped here. We're breaking through that door if anything goes wrong. You're insane! The warning said uh, you'll get stuck out into space if you try to open the doors while the train's in warp. 17 hours in. Wow. I'm gonna lose my mind. Where are we? Can't even take the, off this seatbelt. Tommy, everything will be fine soon enough. I'm sorry, it's my fault for asking to take a warp train. The train seems to be operating still. Oi, take out your tools now. We're cutting off this bloody seatbelt. 31 hours in. That's a whole day. Bloody hell, this is driving me nuts. 300 poor souls are trapped in here. And they do fuck up up. up. <laughs> and they do frick up all about it. The atmosphere is getting eerie. Everyone seems more insensitive than usual. What's funnier is that I'm not feeling any thirst or hunger, even though we haven't had anything in the last few months hours. It won't even leave a dent on this bloody door. Uh, she's uh, trying to saw the door open? Yes, we really are trapped. I don't see a way out. All we can do is wait. Looks like others are slowly losing their minds too. Boy, how about a gamble? What do you mean a gamble? I'm saying maybe we use this. An invitation? It's the stuff I got from Mio. Never thought I'd use it now. Ah, right. Huh. Hmm. So they got trapped and they're trying to use, go to the library to get out? <laughs> what? It's like... There's a old Chinese saying, it's like going from the wolf's den into the tiger's den. <laughs> You're going from a precarious situation into another precarious situation. Here's my pen. I'd do anything to get out of this train too. A malfunction with warp? This could be a huge blow to... W Corp's reputation if it ever gets out to the public. 
We're supposed to arrive at the destination only in 10 seconds, right? Yep. The warp trains operating, uh, the warp trains operating with W Corp singularity, they can get to any station in 10 seconds, no matter how far away they are. A 30 second delay would be big enough issue already, and the 30 hour delay. That's gonna be outright fatal to the corporation to the corporation's trust. Even a singularity can malfunction, it seems. I guess no technology is ever really flawless. Anyway, I might be able to have an unexpected reunion soon enough. You have any familiar faces in that office? No. You mean Mio, the captain of the rapid team then? Yes. Huh, so you ah, had so connections with one of the captains from our corp. That Olga person knowing her is surprising enough, but you might you might have some impressive networking finance too. Finance. Though we probably won't be uh, greeting each other with smiles when we do meet again. What, you weren't friends with her? Uh, you know what? I guess it makes more sense this way. What did you expect? Did you really think I would have any friends to casually chat with? I was just wondering, our corp is different from fixtures of on a fundamental level. Their work might seem similar to what fixtures do, but they take on things of a much larger scale with a much more professional mentality. I expect no less from one of the wings. Aren't you relaxed? Oh, not this is teleportation. Much faster and better than W Corp's idiotic singularity. Are we really sure we can perceive so clearly? You say you got that invitation from our Corp. Mika, shut him up for a bit. I think I'm gonna vomit right here if I hear another peep out of him. Rain, Rain is speaking the truth though. Maybe we should have been more cautious. Sure, sure, no one's on my side. So thanks to my quick judgment that we could escape from that bullet train and uh, into your death. You're gonna get turned into books. Or maybe you survive somehow by leaving your comrades or your friends in the library. Greetings, dear guests. Good to see you too, Lassie. <laughs> Olga is so relaxed and chill. <laughs> I have apologize. We're in a bit of uh, confusion right now, and she's hungover as well. I understand. I don't have experience dealing with drunkards. Hey, you know what the hell was going on back there? Oh, I know it's that you're our guest invited to the library, I'm afraid. Huh, she's a bit nicer than what Neil told me. You know her? You see, we were supposed to dig into the relationship between Old Corp and the library. That's what Mio asked us to do. I see. So that's how you know about me. And you know what's funny, lads? We're talking to a machine, not a person. Let's not anger her now. We're just taking the books listed on the invitation and leave, okay? Let's be blunt, Lassie. You know what relationships uh, the library has with our corp, don't you? You say it's the fact you're in the library is indisputable evidence that this place is, is related to the old corp somehow or another. I'm sure you can find the answer to that in the books you seek. We're terribly sorry. We'll be going in now. May you find your book in this place. Well, oh yes, only one act. Okay, so Olga's page is actually the next, right? The where we want Olga's page. Olga's page is like. Mars page, but better. <laughs> All right, recover three HP whenever the character discards a page. I 
30 or fewer pages are in hand at the end of the scene, gain one strength next scene. You have this uh, speed dice slot plus one. At the end of each scene, restore one light and draw one page if the hand is empty. So I'm looking at piercing and slash. Let's do that. Piercing and slash. Ah, uh, let's take one of these. I don't have any skitter. I don't have enough skitter ways. Uh, we can use the cook at anything. Okay, so I'm. Uh, I need this. And two three costs. Here. Um three costs. Piercing and slash. Overpower. Let's go overpower here. We'll take one of those. Don't I don't think I need the in the preparation anymore. I feel like the preparation is so difficult to use. Multiple block. Um. Hmm. Let's take one of the more those. The I find that the. Uh, dodge is more useful than the... Dodge is more useful than block. Like defensively. Okay, let's do this. I mean, it's only three guys. Shouldn't be too, too hard. Blade Whirl. Let me do this. And the Blade Whirl. Um... Sure.
pale hands. Let's go focus strike here. We'll do one here. And and here restore one life. Do that. Okay, staggered. Okay, staggered once. Kill this guy. Uh overpowered. No, it's not really worth it. Hey. Hey. Let's do this. Oh wait. Oops. I think I used the wrong page. All allies, if the librarian did not deal any damage, they lose 25% HP. Oh my god, okay, I used the wrong. Uh, that's not what I expected. I thought it was the overcharge ability that overcharges a person. I thought it was that one. Overpower. Stagger. Okay. Nice. Well. Blade Whirl. This guy is Stagger. Okay, well, got staggered. Blood. Let's go Fervent Beats. Here, sure. Six six. Yep, 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 yep. That was uh close actually. <laughs> Quite close. Okay, we have 
Book of Olga, Book of Rain, and Book of Mortar Office. Do we have enough? We have two, only two Book of Mika. We have a bunch of Book of Rain that we can burn, and also four Book of Olga that we can burn two off, I guess. Uh, okay, so headgear. Two. 2% chance to boost block dice power by 1. While possessing blood bass am ad ad ab abnormality. <laughs> I keep on I trying so hard to not pronounce that these words for some reason. 5% chance to boost stagger damage by plus 1. Only 5% chance and only plus 1? HP plus 3. That's actually pretty good. Any guesses on why our corp cares about this place? Our corp was a major client of our corp and it disappeared into thin air, so it's natural for them to want to look into it. A major client of our corp, huh? I guess that makes sense. Our corp and its nest. Alcorp and his nest were, weren't really special in terms of military power. It must have been a very important client for Alcorp if they were asked to protect a whole nest. It was a mutual relationship too. Alcorp was supplying all the uh, energy Alcorp needed, and with w, and w Corp depended on Alcorp's energy supply as well. Three wings in collusion with each other, huh? So much for trickle down economy. There's no use complaining to me. I was simply following my orders. Yeah, employees got to do whatever their bosses tell them to do, whether it's the wings or the back streets. Sure. View the third episode of Hot Story. I need to view. The third episode of Isolde. Okay, so we need to get Isolde and then we need to complete a reception using only pages whose costs are odd numbers. Okay, let's do that. Yep, and we have done all of the quests here. Um, okay. There, using only odd pages, right? Send this hook fixture using only odd pages. I mean, there is no absolutely no reason to not use our best key page. So we need a bunch of so slash and slash and pierce. So we need a bunch of like three costs attack. Uh, no, no two costs. Slash and pierce. Retaliate is good. Wait, bra. I don't really understand what this does, but we can try it. I think we had too many three costs. Only odd pages, so one. Let's take one of these. Take one of those. No. Um. You just did one of those. Put in another one cost. Mmm. Do that. Endure. Sure. And okay, let's take a rampage. Let's get rid of one of those. Take a retaliate. Let's 
take a brawl, take a retaliate, and I'm gonna take a insure. Sure, insure. Okay, let's go. 